Honourable Minister Sodi, we are so delighted and uh, honoured having you with us at the Horasis India meeting here in Segovia. And um, you left already uh, such a great impression speaking last night at the opening dinner, the gala dinner, about the value of sport, of course, highlighting uh, Panjab, your state, which is a very progressive state. Uh, and we at Horasis uh, would be most delighted to collaborate with you in the future, eventually hosting one of our events. But I would be interested to learn about your key takeaways so far and about your feedback. Uh, thank you very much, Frank. First of all, thank I, you so much, Minister. I, thank I, you. I must thank you that uh, you gave me an opportunity to be here with you and to uh, on, uh, to address all these deliberations and take part in many, uh, you know, plenary uh, sessions. And I met so many people. And I think uh, this Horace, which you are founder, uh, you have done an excellent job to create a Horace uh, India Meet, and uh, particularly uh, Savogia. And, uh, you know, Savogia uh, being such a lovely town you've chosen, I was talk talking to you yesterday also that I think people have really enjoyed both the conference as well as the stay in this lovely heritage town of Spain. As far as my experience, I feel to meet up people on this uh, platform. It's a, it's a great thing, great organization, Horaces, and uh, your efforts have really brought so many people from different countries, different walk of life, different industries, uh, captain of industries and administrators, uh, like whether it's education or something. So it is a, a wonderful experience which I am carrying back to India and particularly to Punjab. And why I yesterday uh, in my speech I requested you and the Horace's uh, organizers that please uh, there is uh, we from the core of my heart you know I felt that if you could come to us and we host a, a meet of uh, maybe India or maybe some uh, other uh, countries like China or something which can uh, mutually benefit India and uh, my state Punjab for establishing in manufacturing units, in trading, in uh, sports, in uh, youth exchange. So there are so many, uh, you know, fields where we can work together. I fully appreciate and, uh, appreciate and thank you so much, Mr. Minister. Um, and um, I um, share the idea that um, dialogue is so important, um, especially amongst young people uh, who look for direction, uh, the whole um, issue of values directing us. And um, I think you come from um, a very progressive state, a very holy state. Um, if we host a meeting in uh, Chandrika in the, f in the future, I think it would be um, a very good fit and um, inviting a country like China, for example, would be a good idea to bring Chinese investors as well. Uh, we believe that um, dialogue um, also starts with investment. Yeah. Uh, we have a lot of business people here at our meetings, usually um, the corporate houses of India, the corporate houses of China and many other countries. And uh, we are ready. Um, India is very close to my, my heart. And uh, Panjab, uh, in particular, I think, is the, the food basket of India. You have um, uh, a very um, uh, functioning and working um, agricultural industry as well, but also you're moving into high-tech and other areas, the transportation um, economy as well. So we would uh, love to be there, Mr. Minister. And uh, I think um, um, a long journey always starts with the first step. And I think the first step, uh, now having you coming here a long, long way uh, and blessing us with your presence, being with us at Tarasis, we are delighted, uh, Mr. Minister. Thank you very much. But as uh, in my last session, a few hours back, I had an interaction with the Industries and Commerce Minister. And she was uh, very positive and I gave her uh, a, you know, a kind of suggestion yeah. that if she could think of, because in Punjab our farmer is very aggressive. Yeah. You know, my Punjabi farmer has created deserts into fertile land. Ah, yeah. You know, we have a Rajasthan, which is a big desert land. Right. Our people have gone abroad to Canada, America, Australia, where there was a, enough, plenty of thousands of acres of land 
which they have converted into cultivation yeah and now uh, they are bearing very good fruits right so i was talking to her that if you can give some kind of uh, you know uh, incentives to my farmers so there could be a lot of change in uh, spain's agriculture scenario yeah so she agreed on that and she is coming back to me and that's all thanks to uh, you and the horaces platform which gave me an opportunity to meet her also and uh, even she is ready to come to uh, punjab to discuss certain uh, uh, on food processing on agriculture on tourism hmm. so i think uh, your organization and your i would uh, once again thank you that your ability and uh, capability for to take horaces to this site is the credit goes to you and to your team thanks so much mr minister and i'm very glad to see that we have some very practical outcome like the meeting with the spanish minister of industry and you talk about some very concrete projects in the area of uh, food processing spain uh, is quite strong um, in agriculture and food processing and uh, i think they can share their experiences and True. it's a bit the spirit of horaces that we bring parties together um, different countries uh, ministers uh, the entrepreneurs and we do things jointly we very much believe in uh, a multi stakeholder approach where business government and civil society can collaborate yeah you know i must mention here that my chief minister is a ex defense man yeah and he is a former ruler of patiala state which was a, a very big state in uh, punjab and in india before partition yeah and he is very keen on agriculture his uh, forte is uh, defense and agriculture yeah right. so uh, i will discuss as i have invited you all to host your next meeting uh, in uh, india and that particular in punjab chandigarh or uh, anywhere else we could we'll take you your team to golden temple which is uh, you know a very very Uh, sacred place for the Sikh community right and uh, this year we are also celebrating uh, the 550 years of our first guru baba nanak who uh, who is a great guru for the Sikh community so yeah. his uh, birth centenary is coming in november so the celebration would keep on going till another one year right so uh, it's a, it's a very great occasion for uh, the people Uh, of india and the people who are living abroad so i look forward uh, to see you all there and thank you thank you thanks so much mr minister and i will uh, definitely come and uh, uh, i particularly look forward to visit the golden temple and to learn more about uh, the sikh culture of course uh, the philosophy of um, the gurus and uh, the holy places and for our participants as well i think you know that come of course for business but more importantly for culture like here in segovia a lot of indian entrepreneurs go around in the old city and i can already see our participants coming to chandrika and uh, discovering uh, the city and that's a spirit we would like to have thank you so miss ma thank you so much and um, i feel already with a very strong link uh, now with uh, uh, panchab and uh, we will make it happen thank you very yeah. much thanks so much mr minister thank really you. appreciate it